Hello and welcome to Indus News live from Islamabad. I'm Naila Shudra and these are the headlines. The United States has imposed sanctions on five Iranian entities accused of attempting to interfere in the 2020 U.S. presidential elections. Iran's Revolutionary Guard Corps and media groups were among those targeted. The Kurds blocks the U.S. sanctioned assets of the entities besides prohibiting Americans from engaging in transactions with them. U.S. President Donald Trump says his diplomacy with North Korea saved millions of lives by avoiding a nuclear war. During the final presidential debate, Trump accused former President Barack Obama of bringing Washington to the brink of war with Pyongyang. Democratic presidential candidate Joe Biden accused Trump of displeasing the United States allies by cozying up to China, Russia and North Korea. In Sri Lanka, the parliament has given President Goteba Rajapaksa sweeping powers to appoint top officials and dissolve the legislature. The 20th Amendment to the Constitution was passed by 156 lawmakers in the 225-member House. The opposition has accused President Rajapaksa of becoming the constitutional dictator. The U.S. death toll from COVID-19 has crossed 223,000 with more than 8.4 million infections. The second worst hit country, India, has recorded 690 overnight deaths with the tally crossing 117,000. Its caseload has exceeded 7.7 .7 million with more than 54,000 new infections. Meanwhile, Pakistan has registered 13 deaths overnight, pushing the toll to 6,715. Globally, the virus has claimed more than 1.1 million lives while infecting over 41.6 million people. For the latest news updates, you can follow us on our social media at indus.news.